Good afternoon and happy Wednesday, everybody. It is a beautiful day here in uh, Clintonville. Um, this is a test of a, a series that I'm thinking about running, uh, doing a weekly vlog. Um, it is uh, definitely new for me and a little out of my comfort zone, so I hope you'll follow along um, on this journey. Um, no GoPro on a drone or anything like that, um, but maybe we could get there one day and uh, if anybody knows Casey Neistat, he does a pretty interesting um, YouTube vlog, and maybe we can grow it um, like that someday as well. Um, so what I want to do is just kind of talk a little bit about um, local events. Um, you know, I am based out of Clintonville, so you'll see a lot of localized um, info, um, but I certainly want to expand from there. I'll also kind of talk about you know what things am I doing. Personally, um, my personal life and with real estate, talk about some experiences. Um, of course, I'll plug my, my listings and uh, maybe make it a little more informational going forward as well. So happy to have you. Thanks for viewing. Uh, press the like button, of course. Um, help me get this uh, thing exposed and uh, go from there. So I did have a chance this morning to attend uh, the North Area Real Estate association meeting, a uh, little bit of a mouthful, um, but it's essentially the uh, Clintonville area uh, realtor association. ton of uh, experience packed into the room. Um, it's great to be a part of it and, and meet everybody and, and kind of be the future um, of that as well. Um, so appreciate being a, a part of that. Um, in the future, I'll be able to kind of preview homes for my clients in Clintonville, Clintonville which will Hopefully, give me a little bit of edge in the area as well. Um, some upcoming uh, events. The Clintonville Area Commission meeting is uh, the 7th at 7, so that's tomorrow. The uh, reason I'm bringing it up specifically is that the Clintonville Greenways um, is a topic, so it is kind of a, an idea that's in motion to connect Clintonville um, for casual riders and families uh, between Indianola and the bike path. And I think it's a great idea. I had a chance to check out the Indianola bike lane uh, last week, and it is um, it's nice. If anybody's um, you know used to riding on the road, um, busy roads can certainly be a little um, uh, dangerous and a little scary. So hopefully this encourages more people to get out and uh, ride. So check that out if you get a chance. If you're in the area, I'm gonna certainly keep everybody updated on the vlog as I learn more as well. Um, something else that's going on in Clintonville, um, it looks like I will be um, captaining a house for the Clintonville Homes Tour October 8th. It's from 1 to 5 p.m. Um, I'm going to be doing some plugs. I will need um, a couple volunteers for that. Um, basically, we'll just be um, hosting a tour at a specific house. It's in West Beachwald, which is just down the road um, from here. And um, Really cool street, um, some cool houses. Um, I kind of roped my uh, my brother uh, Thomas and his uh, wife Angie into uh, to doing it. So thank you, and um, I'm going to be looking for three to four more people. So um, if you're interested, shoot me a message, and I'll certainly get you signed up and send you more information. Um, so both the Clintonville Area Commission um, and the Homes Tour, I'll have links below um, so you can kind of find out about them. What am I up to? Um, so if anybody knows me, um, I'm a big cyclist. Um, cyclocross uh, season is upon us. The first preseason race just happened this past weekend in Mason, Ohio, um, and it was great um, to kick off the season and kind of figure out how uh, fit or unfit I really am. Um, it's put on by a uh, development team, Lionhearts Junior Racing. Um, basically what that means is you get to race against uh, some really fast young riders and uh, and they get to, to kick your butt. So uh, it was fun um, and uh, it was really good to hang out with my Roll Bike Shop family and uh, a new team that I'm part of uh, called the Monogram Mambas. So. Um, check out my personal page if you want to uh, see some pics over there. Um, I'm also going to be reaching out to a couple, they don't know this yet, or maybe they do. Um, I'm going to be reaching out to some local series, uh, race series, to talk about sponsorship, um, 
maybe some cool things we can do um, together. So more to come on that if, uh, of course, if they'll have me. Um, so my listings right now, um, I have uh, an investment property uh, that's listed right now at 670, 672 South Hamilton and Whitehall. It is a true turnkey property uh, with uh, quite a bit invested to make it, um, you know, kind of a plug and play and a perfect or uh, a perfect first time or season investor uh, type property. Um, and I'd love to show anybody that's interested, um, message me directly if you want to check it out or let me know if you know anybody that might be interested. Um, I do believe that um, Clintonville is going to see a bump in inventory this fall. Um, so for my Clintonville buyer clients, a couple of you out there, um, please you know, definitely keep your fingers crossed that we'll have some, uh, some pretty cool stuff to look at soon, um, some unique houses over here. So um, just wanted to keep this one short. Um, my experience so far um, living this uh, real estate life has been positive. Thank you so much for the support. Um, Thank you for the referrals. I've gotten a few referrals, um, so I'm definitely building my, uh, my client base. Um, and as always, keep me in mind if you um, or your friends or family are looking to buy or sell, um, I'm, uh, I'm going to continue to push that I am the, uh, the Columbus, Ohio, you know, Central Ohio uh, cycling community contact for real estate. So I'm um, looking forward to growing that. Um, this is edition one. Um, I'm probably going to post this version because it was a little bumpy to see how much better it gets later. Um, thank you. And uh, I'm going to think of something cool that we can plug in here as kind of an ongoing theme. Um, so I'll think about that. More to come. Have a great day.